Hi friends, it's Miss Erin from the Carroll County Public Library. And my four silly goats. Root beer. Sassafras. Ginger snap. And peanut. These four silly goats are very curious about cars. We're gonna explore cars today. We're gonna sing some songs, read some books, and do some activities. Climb on in, grab the steering wheel. Let's go. Vroom, vroom, vroom. We're gonna do a car rhyme. Are you ready? Lots of cars driving down the street. Tell me the colors of the cars you meet. Red, beep, beep, beep. Green, beep, beep, beep. Blue, beep, beep, beep. Do I hear your horns beeping? Yellow, beep, beep, beep. Orange, beep, beep, beep. How about this one? This is a crazy car. Pink with black, tiger stripes. Beep, beep, beep. Look at this book I found. On the cover, there's a cow driving a car. The title is Moo. Moo by David LaRochelle. He wrote the words to this story. He wrote a lot of moos. Moo. Moo? The cows. Sees the farmer putting out a car for sale sign. I wonder what Cal is thinking. What do you think Cal wants to do? Moo? <gasps> Moo! Oh, Cal looks excited. <gasps> car for sale. That's fun too. This is a fun book to read. You ready, friends? Can you move like cow going up and down the hills driving in the car? Moo! This is a fun book to read. There's a lot more adventures that Cal has uh -oh, in this story. And it's all told with, you're right, moose. Moo, 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 moo. Moo, moo, moo. I like to imagine if there were goats in the car, then it wouldn't be a book called, titled Moo. It would be a book titled Ah. Right? And then maybe when the goats go over up and down the hill, it would go <laughs> So maybe we have to create our own book and tell our own story about goat a goat driving a car. 
This book gave me lots of ideas, and it was fun to read. I hope you enjoy it, friends. Here's another book I found at the library, Let's Draw Vehicles with Crayola. In this book, each page has a diagram of shapes to use when creating these pictures. I made some race cars. Now let's drive in one. All right, friends. We are going to pretend that we are in a race car. Are you ready? I have my steering wheel. Do you use my imagination? You're going to use your imagination, Peanut? Here we go. Honk, honk, honk. Beep, beep, beep. Vroom, vroom, vroom away. Oh, what fun it is to drive our racing car today. Four new tires, one loud horn, shiny hood and doors. Fasten your safety belts. It's time to race some more. You want to get in? Want to come to the race car? Let's get in. Here we go. Hold on, Ginger Snap. Let's sing our song again. You ready? Honk, 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 beep, 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 vroom, vroom, vroom away. Oh, what fun it is to drive our racing car today. Four new tires, one loud horn, shiny hood and doors. Fasten your safety belts. It's time to race some more. Hold on. Now that we sang some songs, and read some books. Let's look at the parts of a real car. Here's the steering wheel that helps us turn. And here is the gear shift. Right now it's in P for park. Then there's R for reverse. That means going backward. N for neutral and D for drive. That means going forward. Here's the brake pedal for stopping and the accelerator, that I call the gas pedal, for going forward. Brum, brum, brum. And here's the back seat. See the seat belts? And here's the front seat. Sassafras is taking a look inside. Sure, Sassafras, go ahead. Get a closer look. Climb on in with me. Here we are in the front seat. This is a steering wheel. Oh, did you do that? Hear it again? Hey, that was the horn. Oh, look, and here are the wheels. They have tires. And here's the tail lights. They're the lights at the back of the car. And here's the headlights. They're in the front. They're important because they light the way in the dark. Okay, let's pop the hood and look in the engine. Oh, Root Beer's taking a very close look. Oh, Root Beer, what do you see in there? All these parts work together to make the car run. Belts and spark plugs, converters and fluids like oil and transmission fluid and windshield wiper fluid. There's a lot of things under the hood. That's very important. Oh my, look at the outside of the car. It's all dirty. Ew, looks like there's bird poop on this car. That reminds me of a book I wanna share with you, friends. And this is one of my favorites. This is titled, Car Goes Far. It's all about a little car who gets very, very dirty and needs to go to the car wash. That's right. Oh no, in this picture, mud gets on the car. Oh no, and then smoke gets on the car. Oh, car is so messy. Oh no, and this is vice what makes me laugh. Birds make a mess on the car. That's right, bird poop all over car. What is car going to do? Yep. We got a bucket some soap and a rag and water. And we tried to wash the car at home. But you know what? I forgot that goats don't like water. Sassafras and root beer kept running away. 
I guess we're going to have to drive through the car wash. So come on, let's go on a car wash adventure. When you climb into your car before you start the engine, first thing you should always do, click on your seat belt. Don't forget you silly head. Don't give me excuses. Stretch the belt across your tum. Click on your seat belt. Goats in the front seat, goats in the back. Goats in the front seat, goats in the back. Put on my seat belt, clickety clack. Let's go riding in the car. Since root beer and sassafras are goats, not people, they need to ride in the very back. I see you in my rear view mirror, sassafras. Let's go riding in the car, car. Let's go riding in the car, car. Let's go riding in the car, car. Let's go riding in the car. Let's go riding in the car. What do you think, Rudy? What do you think, sassafras? I'm gonna let you blow the horn. I'm gonna let you blow the horn. Ding. I'm gonna let you blow the horn. Ding, ding. Let's go riding in the car. Before we go through the car wash, let's stop at the gas pumps and put some gas in the car. That's what helps it go. Someday, I'll have an electric car, and then I can just plug it in. There's a car in the car wash. We have to wait our turn. Let's pay using this machine. Oh, look, the car ahead of us is getting a little scrub. It's almost our turn. There's a red X that says, don't go in yet. We have to wait for the green arrow. <gasps> there it is, let's go. Here we go, Rudy. Here we go, Sassy. Ooh. Ooh. Look, we get to stay all dry in the car. Stop. Don't worry, Sassafras. The water will stay on the outside. First, we're getting a little rinse, and then we'll get some bubbles and a scrub. Pretty. The soap suds are all different colors. What is it, Rudy? Now it's tickling the sides. Cleaning the sides. Almost done. Now a quick rinse, and then we'll get dry with things that look like giant hair dryers. Now the car is all clean and dry. Time to go home again. I'm gonna take you home again. I'm gonna take you home again. I'm gonna take you home again. Let's go riding in the car. Ma, 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 ma. Let's do it and go. Ready? Ma, 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 ma. Uh-oh, I see a sign. What does that mean? Stop! Oh no, here's a traffic light. Red means stop. Put on the brake. Oh, green light. Green means go. Put on the accelerator. Push the gas pedal. Mm. Sassafras and Root Beer like to look out the window while we're driving home. What do you see, Sassafras? What are you looking at? Oh, what's that, friends? Oh, Sassafras sees an airplane. I wonder what Sassafras is thinking. Hmm.
Oh, sassafras, now you want to fly in an airplane? Hmm, how about you pretend to be an airplane? Wow, you're fast, sassy. Well, while sassafras is dreaming of flying in an airplane, I need to do something about the inside of the car. It's stinky. So, I'm going to make a car air freshener. All I need is a piece of cardboard cut out to the shape I'd like and some felt and essential oil. I'm going to sandwich the cardboard between two pieces of felt, add some essential oil, and mmm, smells good in here now. Well, friends, I hope you had fun learning about cars with my four silly goats. You can check out more materials on cars at library.car.org. Like this Make and Learn Kit Road Stampers Activity Set. You can use the stamps included to make roads. You can use the challenge cards or you can make roads however you'd like and drive some cars through them. Hmm, it was a little hard with these silly little goats stepping all over my paper and eating it. Oh my goodness, Peanut. Here's a book titled Twinkle, Twinkle, Little Car. Oh, that will be a fun book to sing to. And here's another one, Poemobile's Crazy Car Poems. This book is titled How to Build Cars. I had a lot of fun with this book. Here's a table of contents, all sorts of cars that you can build. I decided to build two different kinds of cars, two cars that are powered with air. See the balloon in the back? I made one with cardboard and then one with a plastic bottle. But my favorite was a rubber band car. I had a lot of fun making and decorating this car and then racing it and then introducing it to the chickens and the goats, root beer and sassafras were a little frightened when the car started driving towards them. But the baby goats, Peanut and Ginger Snap were very curious about the car. Well, friends, there are so many wonderful books that you can borrow from the library. Here are just a few of them. There are nonfiction books filled with facts and information about cars and fiction books that are lots of fun to read. Remember, friends, it's not too late to sign up for the summer reading program for ages birth through grown-ups. And don't forget to check us out on YouTube, CCPL Kids and Families. Bye, friends!